how to wire the Medusa. First, let's wire the radio. So here we have a two output radio. This is a splitter. So I have two channels going to four channels. Each wire is a channel, don't get confused. So to wire the radio into the equalizers, we're gonna take our first channel, blue and red. So each is gonna be uh, left and right, or right and left, whatever. On the back of this, you're gonna see uh, R, uh, subwoofer, and uh, front. And I'll get this, this is, this is R, and then this is uh, R, subwoofer, and this is front. So we're gonna take our first channels, uh, use the front for the speakers, uh, tweeters, and uh, uh, highs. So we'll just keep the kind of the same pattern. We'll put red on red, and we'll put blue on white. All right, so from here, pick your equalizers that you wanna use for your highs and your tweeters. Each equalizer has an auxiliary in, and a main in, okay? So on the front of the equalizer, there's a button that determines auxiliary or main. We want to put our inputs on main. So uh, when we click it, we can turn um, the speakers off so we can fine tune. If we just want to hear the tweeters, we can just turn everything off and just have the tweeters on uh, and vice versa, okay? So with that said, from the radio front we're going to take our first set of channels. Remember, red was red and blue was white. So we're going to find the in on our equalizer. So in would be these two. Okay? I really hope this is showing on the camera. So uh, we're going to take our red. We're going to put it in our red. Just to make you know things a little simpler. In our blue and our white. Okay, so that's going to be our first equalizer. Let's just call this equalizer for highs. Now we're going to take our second channel and we're going to get our equalizer and find the main. We're going to put the red in the red input and we're going to put the blue in the white. Same pattern. Okay. Now we have our highs hooked up. We still have one more equalizer. This equalizer will be for subs. Again, same thing, we're gonna find the main. And we're gonna hook it up the same way. So the sub output. We're gonna take our red. We're gonna stick it in our red. We're gonna take, uh, this is black, but we're gonna use it as white, right? So this will be your sub preamp. We're gonna do the same thing. Stick it in the red. It's gonna go in main. The other side is gonna go in white. Down a little tight, so I might put that one at the top. get a little longer one for that one but anyways so this is how your radio should look like we have two channels split going into the bottom highs and tweeters we got one channel going into the top for the subs the medusa don't get intimidated by all these wires it's just wires I got a PRV Medusa. If my phone doesn't fall. I mean, you can probably roll over this thing. It won't do anything. To begin with, you have power, ground, and remote. Um, if you're watching this, or if you're planning to do this yourself, um, I would hope um, you have at least a little bit of knowledge on how to hook up a basic amp or in a radio. So uh, you kind of know where these go. But uh, for the sake, we'll run through it real quick. All of these things 
radio, equalizers, all of them need power, ground, and remote, right? For example, the radio is going to have a red power. The ground remote on a lot of radios are longer, just uh, for frequency reasons. And then uh, one of these is going to be remote. Remote control, system remote control, right? So you're going to take this wire. Matter of fact, all of them. All of them have a power, ground, and remote wire. They're all going to be green, I mean red for power. All of them will be red for power. You'll have a black for ground. And you'll have a blue for your remote wire. You'll take all the wires, all the red wires, and you'll put them together with the Medusa, right? All the red wires, power wires, you put them together. All the black wires, your ground wires, you're going to put those together. Two, three, four, four wires, put those together. Your blue remote wires, you're going to have four, one, two, three, four blue remote wires, you'll put those together, okay? So that takes care of power. All these will have power. Now, how do you get the radio frequency to the amps? I'm going to show you. So, the PRV Medusa has numbers on it. One, two, four, three, and so on. All the way up to, I believe this one has ten channels. Nine and ten. The last one. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take our one and two here. So, uh, on the back of, I'm just going to take this out. Just, uh, just taking this out just to clear this up a little bit. Okay. So, we have one and two. So each of the, uh, I'm just going to take this one out, each of the equalizers have a front and rear output. Front and rear, okay? So when you have it hooked up, um, let's just say uh, we'll do the highs for now, right? So let's just, this is for the speakers and this is for our tweeters, all right? So we want to take number one and put it, uh, let's just use uh, uh, odds for red. Or if you remember, left and right. But for the sake of this video, one is red. We're going to have number two for white. All right? So this is the speakers, all right? So we're going to take number three and four. And we're also going to put them on so three we're going to put on red and four we're going to put on white okay so now we have the highs and tweeters hooked up to the medusa and we already went over the powering ground so one two three and four we still have five and six this is our sub equalizer. The sub has a different output. I want you guys to check this out. The sub output is over here. On most equalizers, they'll have a separate sub output. So we're going to take our, our five and put it in the red. We're going to take our six and put it in the white. Okay. All this, all this is set up inside of the radio box, okay? Now, let's move on to the other side. 